The overall goal of this procedure is to fabricate and operate a microfluidic device for protein crystallization X-ray diffraction data collection at room temperature. The main advantage of this technique is that crystallization inside the chip minimizes the mechanical disturbance of the protein crystals. These X-ray transparent chips are easy to produce, can be directly mounted on goniometers of most singleton beam lines and make efficient use of available crystals when collecting X-ray diffraction data. First, place a master mold of the X-ray chip design in a 10 cm Petri dish lined with aluminum foil. Mix together about 30 grams total of PDMS base and curing agent in a 10 to 1 ratio and pour the PDMS onto the master to a height of 4 millimeters. Degas the PDMS in a vacuum desiccator for 5 minutes and blow air to remove remaining air bubbles on the surface of the PDMS. Cure the PDMS in an oven at 70 degrees Celsius for 1 hour. Then gently peel the cured PDMS mold from the master. Use a scalpel to cut away the excess PDMS. Prior to X-ray chip fabrication, ensure that the workspace is arranged to allow easy access to all needed equipment and components during epoxy mold casting. To begin the chip fabrication, dilute the precursors of a two-component epoxy resin with ethanol to a final ethanol mass concentration of 40% by weight. Using a vortex mixer, mix epoxy resin and ethanol together. Degas the PDMS mold in a vacuum desiccator.